All right, YouTube. Hey, Josh here, Attica Lumber Company. Check out this project right here. This is actually a 30 by 64, 14 feet tall. Now, in this video, I'm going to share with you the textured metal that we did on this. Now, if you're looking at this, actually, it's the wainscot, all right? Let me kind of get you a little bit better angle there. But 30 by 64, 14 feet tall there. And two overhead doors there, 12 by 12, all right? And then a nice 8-foot porch as well. But let's actually take a look at this textured wainscot. All right, now if you've been following this video series, the channel here, I profile and highlight a number of different pole barns, post frames. But you can see right here, check out this textured. I think you'll be able to see here. I looked at this before I filmed this, but you can see this right here. Check out that black right here, sidewall metal. See that? It's got a little shine to it. I wouldn't say shine, but you can see it's a little bit more, uh, I don't know, sparkle to it. And then if you go down here, check that out right here. That's kind of like a charcoal, charcoal, but look at that. See that? It's a textured, so there's no glare on there. See that? You got the sidewall panel right there, the black, and then you dip down there. See that charcoal? So a textured. Why would you do a textured? Well, some people don't like the that uh, maybe the shine effect there of that sidewall panel, and they chose to go with or choose to go with a, a textured pattern. All right. And then you can see right here this eight foot style porch coming off there see that right there you can see we did a white ceiling now this color actually you can come in a variety of different colors now we found this channel with the gray black as well but you can see right here we chose to go or the owner chose to go with a white liner panel underneath the porch right there all right so you can see in process there you can see these windows right here an anderson window a black window and also on the other side there all right, so you can get your windows to, to color coordinate or match your sidewall steel there. All right, see that black window as well right there. So again, you don't have to go with a white uh, window trim. Again, there's options out there if you want to color coordinate your building. All right, and then you can see the black overhead door trim as well. So a sharp looking building right here, charcoal and black. All right, now let me go around and then we'll go inside now mentioned a few things as well but check out that texture pattern right there maybe you can see that a little bit better there see that yeah you can really see it right here see how the shine there on the sidewall panel and then you got the texture all right so let's go inside here and take a look at this again four foot on center truss spacing on this all right again we're utilizing a drip stop that comes pre-assembled pre-applied to the underneath of that metal again that comes with a 20-year warranty all right, again, proof for animal confinement. This is not going to be an animal confinement building. All right, but again, a 20-year warranty drip stop. It's kind of got a fuzzy texture pattern to it. All right, and again, you can see here, three-ply laminated columns. Again, 30 foot in width there. Again, southern yellow pine glued, finger jointed, laminated together. Again, you see treated at the bottom here. Now, this is actually in the county of... Sadusky County, all right, right here in Ohio. So we actually drilled down 54 inches, but you can see Southern Yellow Pine, glued finger jointed, laminated together, treated at the bottom. You can see how that's spliced. You got a pressure point there, one. You got a pressure point, two. And then also you got a pressure point, three. All right, so three-ply laminated column. If you've been following these videos, three-ply is pretty a popular choice, but again, I've highlighted four plies. You know, concrete perma columns, what set brackets. This kind of depends on the use case and the size of the building. All right, so that kind of gives you an idea. Again, another one in progress, a 30 by 64, 14 feet tall. All right, so good looking building. And black seems to be a pretty popular color. All right, so again, all comments, always welcome. Till next one, keep it locked, keep it loaded right here. Attica Lumber, at the Attica Lumber.